Okay, I don't have a microphone on my camera today, so hopefully the audio in this video is okay. It should be, I trust my camera microphone, so it just won't be as good as normal. Anyway, look what I've got to climb every morning. That little bump there, which doesn't look like much, but it's actually terrifying, because when you're not wearing snow boots, as I'm not right now, there's less grip and you can easily slip down. Today it looks quite chunky actually, and when it's chunky it's easier to climb, because you can just place your feet in between the chunks of snow. But other times when it's really smooth and there's fresh snow, it's a lot harder to climb. Look at this. What a view. Today is the last day of the year, 31st of January 2023. It's also the first time in about two weeks, maybe even more, that I've actually seen daylight. It gets light for about two, two and a half hours every day here. The sun never properly rises, so you kind of have this kind of sunset light feel the whole time, as you can see behind me now. Um, which is actually really pretty for photos, it makes it look very wintry. But it's also kind of depressing and you get less vitamin D, so pros and cons. Um, it's minus 13 right now, I'm actually feeling it a bit. Normally, I was texting my friend yesterday saying that I've gotten used to minus 12, because it was minus 12 yesterday and I could walk around in just my jumper without my coat and no gloves and be fine. Today, it's a little bit more chilly. Minus one degree more, doesn't make that much of a difference. But anyway, I'm gonna to go to the Santa Claus village today. I'm gonna to get the bus there. I just might shoot some photos or something I've got the day off, so just using it to create some content, I guess. And then, because it's New Year's Day, they might also do fireworks in the center of town. I haven't researched that, I've just been told. So if they're doing that, I might go to town and get some videos of that as well. And that'll be my New Year's, New Year's Eve actually, I'm working on New Year's Day. So what you can see behind me now, all the way in the distance over there, I include a B-roll shot of it zoomed in on the 85mm, is Unasvara Ski Resort, a ski resort here in Rovaniemi. Finland isn't known as the greatest downhill country, it's all very flat. I mean, they probably do quite well in the Winter Olympics, don't really follow it too much um, due to the winter nature of the country, but it's very, very flat. There's not many big hills or mountains like in Switzerland or Austria to do downhill skiing. So when they have a hill such as that one, they normally have a ski resort on it because it's like one of their only opportunities to do it, although it's not really like a mountain like in the Alps. But yeah, that's their ski resort. No proper black, I don't know how they're labeled, super dangerous runs, but a bit of downhill stuff. It's There are ski jumps actually. There's a couple of ski jumps over there, but I think they're too far away to get on camera, even on the 85 mil. But yeah, they do have quite a few ski jumps here in Finland. They've got some down south as well near Helsinki, but it's more known for cross-country skiing, like you see a lot of in Norway as well. Scandinavia, they do a lot of cross-country skiing, even just to get around, so that's more of their thing than downhill skiing. But yeah, over there is Unasvara Ski Resort, Rovaniemi Ski Resort. Unasvara is the name of like the neighborhood area, by the way. So as you will have seen from the footage from my camera, which I just put in my bag conveniently a moment ago, I've been taking photos at the Santa Claus village, which you can see behind me for the past 
couple hours or so, I'm sure you've already seen them or you'll be about to see them. Shooting on, I only brought two lenses today, shooting on the 1735 f2.8 Canon EFL lens and then also the 85 f1.8 Lumix lens. Yeah, really proud of some of the photos I got. Got some of one of the elves from Tantra Park and who I work with. Very good photos actually, I can't wait to edit those. And yeah, of the tourist environment of Santa's village as well. Anyway, gotta get going now. At least to do shopping. I don't know if I'm gonna go to the centre of town, like I said, to see fireworks. Have to see what happens with that. Hopefully you've enjoyed the B-roll from Santa Claus Village. So thank you very much for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe if you are new to the channel, the button's down below, click it, and whilst you're there, turn on post notifications as well, so that you don't miss a video when I upload. If you have turned post notifications on, I'll see you in the next one. Hasta luego.